Hello guys, and welcome to another NK Mobile video. Guys, today uh, we are taking a look at survival mode Fatal Tower. I figured I didn't complete one uh, for a while. And this is my team. I chose to use Warlock Quanchi, Slasher Jason, and Noxious Reptile. The reason being, Noxious Reptile is in the team so that he can uh, enhance the bleeds of Slasher Jason. This is the equipment I gave to uh, this guy. Uh, this is the equipment I gave to Jason. This is the equipment I gave to Reptile. As you can imagine, they don't really have anything overpowered on them because I wanted to, this to be like a regular run. Uh, and these are the talents that I have uh, here. Hawk stance because Jason will stack up to 70% resistance to the buffs. It's important for him not to get a death mark. That's really important. And basically, this is the... I don't know why I have on Black of Breakable Will. Oh, because I, I remember now, I, I did some uh, Sorcerer Tower. Uh, it doesn't matter. I don't really require Breakable Will, but I have it. So, uh, yeah, basically, battle number 8. Let's go and assert some dominance using his uh, Slasher Jason team. Quite honestly, I really, really love Slasher Jason. He's my favorite Jason by far. Uh, and in my opinion, he's the best out of three Jasons, especially Fusion Zero. Why can One can argue that uh, some other Jason is better at highest Fusion. But at Fusion Zero, I hope that nobody denies the fact that Slasher Jason is simply... Unstoppable! Slash Jason is unstoppable Fusion Zero. <laughs> Anyways, now, um, we have to face Jade, which is a little bit unfortunate, um, because, you know what, I'm going to do that, because uh, I will make her bleed, and from this point on, she'll be kind of, oh, actually, she just did. Alright, the Revenant saved her, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, okay, alright, she did now. Uh, now I will, right off the bat, I'm going to do special one. With this particular setup guy, Jason lives twice thanks to his uh, talents. No, uh, thanks to his past, I'm sorry. Uh, and, uh, you know, I'm going to do that. And he can be resurrected by Quan Chi. So that's pretty overpowered. And, oh my god, I have double poison on me. That's unfortunate. Okay. Alright. Special one. Speed poison on this guy. Another special one. Speed poison on this guy. Slash can open. Actually, I just realized that spitting poison on this guy is useless. <laughs> but it doesn't matter. We win anyways. Uh, so, battle number 8 was easy. But we need 4 more battles in order to complete this fatal tower. That's battle number 10. I'm oh, sorry, 9, 10, 11, 12. So, I hope we won't be facing a lot of teams to MK11 Jade, because MK11 Jade is going to be a difficult matchup. It's not unbeatable, definitely, but difficult. Uh, so, battle number 9 is going to be against a combat cup team. Uh, I'm okay with that, however, I will start with uh, Jason. Reason being, I don't want my Quan Chi uh, to be uh, stunned when he tries to tag out. Uh, I want Quan Chi to survive, because Quan Chi is the guy who resurrects the others. Nobody can save him. And I don't have Reverend, I don't have Bone Shield, I don't have any equipment that can actually uh, revive Quan Chi, so we have to be careful with him. He shouldn't be dying, guys. Uh, he should live. Alright, so... Uh, this Johnny is an unfortunate matchup, but... Uh, actually, it's not really that unfortunate, because I'm just going to... Oh my god, look at the damage! Look at the... Oh my god! Oh! <laughs> no, 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 this thing cannot happen more than once, like, more than twice. Twice is the absolute max kill, and the, and the Revenant goes down! No, no, Johnny, Johnny, my boy, you got two lucky mates, and you got Revenant, but this is not enough to defeat the mighty Jason, and this guy's immortal! Uh, but he cannot power drain me, alright, uh, he's immortal, alright, I'm just going to uh, take this opportunity uh, to generate some power in the process, okay? And I'll make him bleed right now. All right. I'm going to do this again. I think this should be enough. And then Cassie will come. And then I'm going to do... Oh my god, again! Just tag out. All right, tag out now. All right, beautiful. I was ready with my special one, but for some reason I couldn't do that. For some reason. Oh my god. All right, so should I... You know what, uh, it, at this point it will be better for me, I believe, to die. Because uh, if I die, I will uh, regenerate more health than 16,000. I might be wrong, Let, let's see. I, I forgot what was the health that he came back with. Alright. Alright. Oh no, he's going to get resurrected. Oh, I, I got healed, so 26 is better than 15. So I'll take that, I'll take that. Uh, yeah, first, by the way, Quan is going to save Jason, and, Jen, and then Jason can regen re rejuvenate. He doesn't actually rejuvenate, he revives twice. Alright, next battle. 
Not number 10 is against our good friend Mr. Sanguinario, the chosen one. And the chosen one is playing a team that is not really chosen. <laughs> and for some weird reason, Possessed Kench. I mean, Possessed Kench is not really the worst starter, but still, uh, yeah, I mean, he can be played as a starter, why not? You're kind of losing one tag in immediate tagging, but it's not a big deal uh, because he just sets one character on fire. And in a lot of cases, the starter of any team has the most uh, re uh, resistance to the boss and stuff. So there's a very high probability that he's going to resist uh, whatever you have for him. All right. I'm going to just... Oh my god, special one of Jason is simply brutal. Look at the damage. And, and the bleak hasn't kicked in yet. So basically... The ball shield goes down! I forgot what that thing is, quite honestly. I'm going to kill him through the bone shield. And the revenant now? Can I have a revenant as well, Proking, please? Oh my god, you disappoint. You disappoint. You disappoint. I'm a such a Jason is so good, guys. I can literally kill everybody without tagging out. But at some point, I just want to tag out so I can make it a little bit more interesting because, uh, you know, just slashing people like this. Uh, and look at this guy, he's... Oh, then the bone shield! Go Even with 10 million bone shields, it won't be enough. You're going down, my friend. Oh my god. Okay, Tremor. No, no. I'm going to do it. By the way, I have my morning coffee, it's pretty, pretty cool. Yeah, Jackie goes down. Exactly, and this guy with the bow. Oh, and the Revenant shield goes down! Alright, I'm going to just finish him off. Actually, can you kill me so I can generate more health? That's going to be pretty awesome. Kill me. Yes! Well, I got some health in the process. So I'm going to do this because it looks cool. I don't really care about the minigame because he's dead, anyways. So, yeah. Alright, so I believe we have two, two games left, guys. This game wasn't really that difficult. The whole thing went wrong when the enemy team got 10 million bone shields, revenants and stuff. But let's be honest, this can happen to any character. It's not just slash or Jason fall to something. Bone shield and revenant is just proc and there's nothing you can do, right? So you have to live with that. Alright, battle number 11 is against uh, Scorpion with Melina. Hmm, interesting team composition. And I'm going to use my World Quan Chi as start again. Uh, for two reasons. First thing that uh, he can basically freeze the enemy. And when Slash or Jason comes, he's going to have a free combo uh, and uh, he'll be gaining more power, right? So, <laughs> basically, this is the main reason. Apart from that, I don't want to you know, use World of Quan Chi as my starter because I don't want him to get killed. But if you have the Ice Bomb maxed out, which is probably the best green piece in the game, tower piece in the game, then basically you're good to go. Alright. Alright. Now, this is the bad combo ender slash Jason. After this combo ender, you always have to follow by special one, because if you don't, you're going to get wrecked. So, he has one good combo and one bad combo. Uh, this is the good combo. You see? This is the good one. Uh, and this is the bad one. This is the bad one. Actually, in this particular case, it was a good one, because it killed the guy. But in a lot of cases, it's going to be a bad one. Because uh, if you don't have power, the enemy will start punching you, and he's going to interrupt your chaining. And you don't want, and you don't want this to happen ever. This is the good combo. Now look at this, this is the bad combo. He's, she's going to start punching me immediately. Yeah. In this case she had power, so I couldn't really stop her from destroying me. But it is what it is. I have uh, three more lives, so I'm perfectly fine. Uh, what is this guy going to do? <laughs> oh my god, he has X-Ray! I wonder whether he's going to use his X-Ray right now, or whether he's going to bleed to death before it, he has it available. He's going to use it right now. I'm perfectly fine with that. He's going to just curse me, and I'm fine with that. Jason, look at this. Jason doesn't feel even require block breaker, guys. He's that good. No need for block breaker. I'm just playing a regular team with regular equipment. Only, let's say, kind of... Uh, I wouldn't say unfair, but let's say difficult to max out is the green ice bomb, but you can do it easily without it. I mean, it's just uh, for convenience, right? If you don't have this, you can use, for instance, Blaze's Life Force on Quan Chi. That would be good. Or something like this. Uh, yeah, I, I, the ice bomb is really amazing. Unfortunately, guys, you can really max it out if you... Uh, oh, Diamond Team, that, that's good, that's good. So, uh, you can uh, max the ice bomb easily if you're playing Ice Link Way Tower the first time right because if the link way tower comes back as a repetitive tower repetitive repeated tower <laughs> uh, she, uh, it will be available just for four weeks and for four weeks it's, go it's going to be difficult to max it out unless you spend something right if you spend some tiny amount of money probably you'll be able to max it out but if you don't then you are in a lot of trouble 
but uh, but uh, you are in a lot of trouble. I mean, you won't be able to march it out. All right, so uh, Raiden, there you go. He's already bleeding like a pig. Look at this. He's losing three percent health any every second. All right. The only problem I have with classic Raiden against my particular setup is that he can um, power drain my Jason, but this is no longer a problem because he just dies. <laughs> oh my god, such a Jason is so good. Seriously, absolutely god like is here. Like, how can you possibly deny that? Look at this. Look at this. He wrecked Fatal Tower on his own with regular equipment. Once again, regular equipment. And I have Nimbo Reptile as support. A Noxious Reptile, I'm sorry, not Nimbo Reptile. Uh, and Quan Chi. And the thing is, they can work even at Fusion Zero. They don't have to be uh, really high Fusion Node to assist Jason. They don't. Just use them at Fusion Zero. Like, that would be enough. Of course, if they're high Fusion, that would be always beneficial. Because in certain situations, they'll help you. Uh, if for some reason you need to tag out Jason, he has a death mark or something, so you need to tag him out. And you need some other character just to... Oh my god. Uh, pathetic. Pathetic Quan Chi. You know what? I'm just going to generate some power using the good combo ender, the bad. Oh, sorry, the bad combo ender. I won't. I won't even bother, guys, because Quanchi goes down, and this is one of the easiest fatal towers I've ever did. Like seriously, Slash Jason is a beast. So this is going to be all for today. Let me just show you the end screen of the whole run. Um, I think that there is. Yeah, look at this. Look at this. I never used the other two guys. I don't even remember why I attacked. Oh, I remember I attacked this guy now to kill a reptile or something. But uh, I just realized I didn't have to. I just did it for content. <laughs> and Quan Chi, I, I believe I attacked him once. And uh, yeah, he KO'd the guys uh, in my first one or two battles when it was like... Uh, I was playing Fusion 1 here and stuff like this. Alright guys, so this is going to be all for me today. See you next time. Take care. Perfect.